Welcome back to another video. I've got some batteries to test today and these were sent in via a company called Home Tech and they've got 21700 cells. I have two versions. The first is the standard run which is a higher drain but slightly lower capacity and then we've got the run XL which is a higher capacity cell. These are both unprotected 21700 cells. You can see they've got the ohm engraving on the top. Quite a bit of information on the wraps with these batteries as well as the capacity. They've also put the watts which is unusual. Don't normally get that on a battery and they've given us the constant discharge rate and as well as the maximum discharge rate. We've also got some safety information which is printed on the wrap. I do have some 18650s which I'll be doing a test on probably next week but they are pushing these cells quite hard this company. I haven't used any of their batteries before. This is a quick spec sheet giving you a rundown on some of the cells that they do. We're looking at the two and the far right if you want to pause that and have a look. On screen I have the data sheets for both cells. You can put a pretty high charge into these but if you want to preserve the number of cycles to the maximum you want to give them a charge of 2 amps or under. First discharge capacity test with the normal runs and they both came in over 3000 milliamp an hour and onto the XL they came in both of them at over 4000. One of them was a little bit higher nearly 4200. Thought I'd do a quick internal resistance test on a couple of the batteries. These are brand new so you would expect very low internal resistance and you get exactly that. Readings are very low on these 13 milliohms and 11 milliohms around about 10 milliohms so good performance from the batteries at least in terms of the testing that I've put them through. The only thing to add is real world performance and use. These aren't widely available in Europe so I've never used them myself so long term extended use I'll let you know how I get on. If you have used any of these batteries though do leave a comment below let me know how you found them because feedback is always useful for other people who might be interested in them.